resources to preserve history in Dodge County, West Concord now has a former school on the list of the National Register of Historic Places. Megan Zempel joins us live with more on the opportunity this brings. Jess, I got to visit a historic school at West Concord today, and it was so neat. I could have stayed all day. It was like stepping back in time. The West Concord Historical Society is housed in the old school that closed back in 1994. At the time, the school board wanted it demolished, but a group of citizens got together and formed the Historical Society, buying the building from the school board for $1. Now, it houses pieces of West Concord's past, dating all the way back to the mid-1800s. You can find things like antiques and military pieces dating back to World War I. Nearly every artifact that lives in this old school has touched the life of a resident of West Concord. And as of January, it's now on the National Register of Historical Places. And that's the 11th place in Dodge County to be put on the register. If you want to know um, why things are the way they are now, you really have to look backwards to see the evolution. There was, there was a time when this town was so booming, you know, it had, I remember when it had three grocery stores and two hardware stores, and we know in the early days it had music stores, it had everything. And a lot of the, the commerce and the liveliness was because the railroad was passing through West Concord. And then in, I think, in the 60s sometime, the railroad stopped coming through here. Being on the register will allow the histo Historical Society to get more grants to continue to restore and preserve West Concord's history for generations to come. And they are always looking for volunteers to help catalog and set up displays. And if you want to get involved, we'll have all that information up at KTTC.com. Reporting live, Megan Zemphel, KTTC News. So many